Renowned broadcaster and fearless freedom fighter June Keekley is finally at rest after years of bout against cancer. More of this from Keith Cruz. Seasoned broadcaster and the voice of people power, June Keithley Castro, was finally laid to rest this morning after she succumbed to her four-year battle with breast cancer last November 24. Before this, a mass was celebrated at the ABS-CBN chapel with her family and close friends in attendance. In a video, President Benigno Aquino expressed his sadness over the death of Keatley, but thank her for her contributions in fighting for the democracy in the country. Also at the Mass was Vice President Jejo Marbinay. According to him, no one can compare to the strength and faith in God showed by Keatley during her career in battle with the disease. So personally, what is the difference between the people and the Everybody was emotional when the remains of June Keithley were brought to Loyola Memorial Park in Marikina. It was apparent how the broadcaster touched the lives of her family, friends, and colleagues. And with the impact of both losing his parents, Diego Castro says the family plans to take a rest but unsure on how they will spend Christmas this year. I guess the wishes of parents ko is to take a break muna yung family because si si daddy and then we did bury him. Uh, they wanted to be together, so we had to go through that. Tapos sakit pa ni mami, and then day in, day out hospital, and now she's gone. Diego is also at loss on how to spend his birthday tomorrow. I don't know, and then tomorrow is my birthday, and then a lot of things happening, so I, I don't know how I'm, I'm going to celebrate anything. June's coffin was opened to be able to put the ashes of her husband. This also gave a chance for her family and friends to see June Kisley for one last time. With her contributions in attaining the country's democracy, she was given full military. And as flowers were offered and butterflies were released, her family and friends bid their final farewell to the lady who has given a lot to the country and was a fighter till the end. This is Kate Cruz for News at One, Junior Edition.